somen, traditional white noodles that are thin like threads. Although thin, they have a lovely firm texture. Here's a quick look at somen, born of techniques that go back centuries. Our reporter Saskia visits Sakurai in Nara. Somen noodle production takes place in the dry, cold months of midwinter. Work begins before dawn. <laughs> Dough is made first. Wheat flour is mixed with salt water. あ、気温と湿度に合わせて変えてます。気温が低い時は塩が少ない。で、水の量もあ、2日間で仕上げるんで、今日と明日の天気天候あの見ながらっていう感じですね。あ、2日間ですね。Dough making is the most critical step as it determines the quality of the final product. Well kneaded dough is rotated to compress and smooth it out before being processed into large strips. These are covered in plastic and left to rest for about 30 minutes. The strips are then passed through a roller where they're flattened and then made into rods. Cottonseed oil is brushed on to keep them from drying or sticking together. They're stretched further. The twisting and pulling strengthens the fibers so they won't break down when stretched very thin. It's twisted more as it's woven around two pieces of wood. Rest, stretch, and repeat. This allows the proteins to bind, creating a firmer texture. Day two. After sitting out overnight, the dough will be stretched even more. This is the final step. Here, the noodles are stretched to about one or two millimeters thin. I can't believe that they stretch out so much, almost like threads. It's so cool to see. Lastly, the noodles are dried to keep them from sticking together, cut into equal lengths, and stored in wooden boxes in a warehouse. As the humid rainy season passes, the noodles get even firmer. Test out and savor the hidden strength of Japan's ultra-thin somen noodles.